congratulations on starting your journey into the build of the 750 Cruiser. Okay, we're ready to rivet our skeleton. Now, I have noticed one situation here. The rivet hole is slightly obstructed by the hinge loop. So what we're going to have to do is rivet this first, this hole right there, and then put the hinge back on. Now I'm going to take the rudder skeleton and insert it inside and we simply want to line up the holes and start to clico. We're going to need to adjust the ribs slightly to find the holes. Okay, we're looking at the top of the rudder and I'm going to simply slip our top piece in, in between the skin. Our goal is to look for the red center line through the holes. Here are the parts for the horizontal stabilizer. And here our rivets are in place, except for those rib locations and the center. Now, prior to riveting the ribs to the front spar, I'm going to bring in the rear spar. Now, I've turned this upside down. Notice the brackets pointing up. And our doubler is at the top because we have it upside down. And that doubler will correspond to the joggles on these ribs. I'm going to start by clicoing the spar up front. And this will be located along the top up here. Right like this. And we'll go ahead and clico this in place. And it will slide down. And our goal then is to match this up with the horn so that our corner is not above the edge but as close as possible. Remove the center channel. So whatever clicos are necessary to be taken off to take the channel out but we'll leave our arm in place. We're going to have the barrel down and then unclico along the top here and then we'll slide this underneath the skin in addition to the stainless steel rivet here that we installed we have three more here according to our plans and then one more just around the corner We're going to slip some heat shrink tubing over each of the five wires. Now we're going to install the servo. Our first step was to extend the plunger because that'll make it a little easier when we go to connect the end. Now we need to move it all the way forward until the front edge of our skin almost comes up to the line on the hinge 